Hey everyone, this is Ed from Tech Talk with another quick tutorial. Today I'm going to show you how to use TransMac to create a bootable USB. Just copy the link from the description below, paste it in the browser, and it'll bring you here. Go ahead and click this tmsetup.zip, and then you're going to see it download right here. And you're just going to simply click on it. Once it opens, go ahead and double click the setup. Go ahead and click yes to the user account control setting when you get it. Click next. Click I accept. Click next. 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 And leave these two checked. Go ahead and click next. Unless you don't want an icon on the desktop. Hit install. At the end here, uncheck these because you do not want it to open because we need to run this as, a, as administrator. But we're not going to run it just yet. I'm going to show you where you can download OS X. Um, images, ISOs, at least I've tested the um, the High Sierra and the El Capitan. That works fine. I believe any of these ones here below the beta will work just fine. But if you're looking to download images to boot your iMac or your Mac, find this link in my previous video where I show you how to convert these using Windows, how to convert these ISOs, because you're going to notice these are ISO images. Um, and they're really easy to convert on Windows. So um, I would suggest you click on my link, watch the video, learn how to convert these. And then once it's downloaded, come on over here to TransMac, get it installed, right click, run administrator, click yes. And then um, you can, at this point, go ahead and put your UI in if it uh, just pops up like this and opens. If you get a pop-up saying format, just go ahead and say yes format and select BAT32 if you want to. Otherwise, once you get in, it may, um, may make you close TransMac and reopen it again before it works. But anyways, you'll probably have a 15-day trial period. Um, but that's all right go ahead and hit run and then here i know it's fat 32 already but i'm just going to right click anyways i'm going to do format for mac and say yes and then i mean you can name this any uh anything you want high sierra whatever you want to name it i'm just going to leave it untitled click yes and then just let it format and while this is formatting, I would love to encourage you just to, to hit that thumbs up at least. Um, I would love to have you subscribe as well, but not necessary. But go ahead and click OK to the format. And now we're going to right click on this again. And this time we're going to restore with disk image. And I'm going to go ahead and click here on the dots and select the image. And this is the image that I converted from an ISO to. Um, do a DMG and I'm going to click OK or open and then now I'm going to click OK and this will take um, a little while to to run so be patient and that's it my friends once you see restore complete go ahead and throw that in your iMac your MacBook whatever you're trying to recover and hold the option key and then you're good to go you should see that in the menu and select it and boot from it all right. If you have any trouble or have any questions, please leave a comment below. Uh, thanks for watching. All right. Bye.